Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. For today's look, we're going to be doing this look I made, I have on today. This is a, a brown smoky eye with a hint of purple. Uh, and if you guys want to see how I make this happen, go ahead and keep on watching. So starting off with your base coat, I'm going to be using Soft Ochre by MAC and just apply it all over my lips. Okay, now that I applied my primer, uh, what I like to use is usually I like to set it with some kind of setting powder. Uh, I'm, today I'm using Kat Von D's uh, Shade to Light palette in Lyric. Lyric? Yeah. And I'm just gonna be applying all over my lid, like so. Okay, try to use a fluffier brush. Okay, now that we set our eyes and we're ready, ready to move on, uh, today we're going to be using this Anastasia Modern Renaissance Palette. And we're going to go in with the color hmm, Warm Taupe. This one right here. And we're going to be applying that all over our crease area. We're going to be using this color as a transition color. Gar, which is this orange color and I want to go ahead and apply it to the same place I applied my transition color have this beautiful transition color slapped on you just go ahead and move on to your next step we're going to be using a liner just a regular gel liner and we're going to be applying it all over our lid and today I'm going to be using a flat brush like this I don't know if you can see it like that and yeah just apply it all over your lid you don't want to go all the way up because remember you still have to blend so now what you want to do is try to blend it out I like to blend it out with a flat brush well my gel liner because it just works better my blending brush uh, the gel wouldn't smear as I wanted it to smear you know so you need like a thicker denser brush to help it out you'll see what I mean and just you'll see what I mean while I'm doing it okay so now that you blend it out a little bit you just go ahead and grab your blending brush and that with the same product that it has just try and blend it out a little bit more I like to go in circular motions because that's what I've noticed helps the most. You see how we're getting that smoky look? That's what we want. Okay, so now with that same flat brush, you want to go ahead and set it with a brown shadow or whatever color you want to set it with. I prefer a brown shadow. For my specific look and I don't want to go too harsh with it because I'm still gonna blend it out and I'm gonna be adding another color on top of this so okay so now grabbing my finger I'm gonna be dipping into love letter this one right here and applying it all over my lid where I applied my where I applied my uh, gel liner
I'm gonna be using burnt burnt orange. This one right here. And I'm, I'm gonna be applying it under my eyes. Okay, so now moving on to love letter. Moving on to this color, you want to go ahead and apply it on top of uh, the colors we already had applied before. So now what you want to do is apply eyeliner to your under eye. enjoyed this look and you liked how this look turned out go ahead and leave me a thumbs up and if you want to follow me on instagram my name my name is my name on instagram is makeup by underscore eileen i o double -E -N. go ahead and follow me there and if you recreate this look please be make sure to tag me there i would love to see y'all's recreations and yeah love you guys so much and thank you for being loyal being here with me even though i wasn't posting i'm so happy to be back and I really hope to stay here and if not snapchat me I mean my snapchat is open so my snapchat name is makeup by period Eileen I L double E N so thank you guys so much I love you guys please make sure to subscribe give me a thumbs up if you like this video and yeah thank you bye